understand? I'm saying you might be the true killer. <laughs> what is this? Like, I can only laugh. What are you even saying, you nasty toilet clogging bitch? What? Oh, ja, sie hat halt. Ne, ne? Auf der Party wird zu geschissen. <lacht> Footprints. Footprints on the beach. <laughs> She's not crying, it's obviously fake. <laughs> Do you know where Hyoko was today? I don't know. She was at the beach house, the scene of the crime. I'm sorry. But I didn't go to the beach house. <laughs> no, that's wrong. Small me. Wait a minute. You should have been at the beach house, Hyoko. Seriously, I told you I didn't. But these footprints in the sand in front of the beach house, aren't they yours? I don't have such ugly footprints. They're probably Mekons based on how ugly they are. Don't decide that based on ugliness. Huh. They're not Hyoko's footprints? That's strange. The footprint I collected from your room matches these footprints perfectly. Collected? I never gave you permission to collect that, you nasty pedo! Plus, the footprints left in the sand were facing away from the beach house. Which means, when the owner of these footprints went inside the beach house, they used a different entrance. <clears throat> a different entrance? Are you talking about the door facing the road that Mashiro's body was in? Yes? Are you saying when that person went inside the beach house, the body hadn't appeared yet? The door was still accessible when they went in, and wasn't when they left. Which means something happened in between those two events. Isn't that right, Kyoko? Oh, I remember now. I remember when I went to the beach house. Hmm, so you finally <sighs> decided to confess. Liars are usually liars themselves. If you say I'm lying, prove it. Can you even prove that I'm lying? <laughs> There's no this is like proving a negative. Like idiots like you guys would be able to do that. Like shooting. <laughs> I did go to the beach house. Oh, yeah. But only during my morning walk. Hey! No, that's wrong. Only during your morning walk, huh? Will you still claim that after you take a look at this letter? Hey, yeah, okay, yeah, let's come in, shouldn't Yoko was able to arrange a meeting with Mahiru by exchanging letters with her. What is that letter? I'm serious, I don't know. Oh snap, I remember now. I totally saw you. Huh? Uh, yeah, it's coming with um damit that sie heulend ne, uh, ne, aus dem Diner gesehen hat, ne? 
Also, ne, genau. Hajime met up at the diner around 3 p.m. to go to the beach. Yep. I saw you about 30 minutes later, so it should have been around 3.30 p.m. I see. So if she met Mahiru at 2.30 p.m., killed her, then ran away afterward, I think 3.30 p.m. is a reasonable time for you to have witnessed here. You're wrong! You're totally wrong! Now that you mention it, you also passed by the diner for you, Hiko. So you should have seen Hyoko too, right? No, I didn't. It's just a coincidence that I passed by the diner. I wasn't even paying attention to the beach house. I went straight back to my cottage after I saw you guys. I didn't see anyone during that time. For some reason, that sounds suspicious too. It's the truth. Deal with it. Just leave him alone. It'd be a waste of time to question him any further. Anyway, that letter in Kazuichi's testimony says it all. You were meeting up with Mahiri at the beach house. Seriously? I don't know! I didn't even write that letter! Like, I'm telling the truth! I really, really don't know! <laughs> is she really crying? Or is she faking it? She's probably faking it. We can assume she summoned Mahiru with the intention of killing her all along. That's why she wrote a letter to let her know where to meet, so the others wouldn't find out. And then you went ahead to the beach house, hid yourself in a specific place, and waited for Mahiru. There's evidence for that, too. Hmm, the only place I can think of where Hyoko was hiding is probably that place, right? Spot selection! Select a suspicious spot. Here, I have Baldo gefunden. <laughs> Are you talking about the closet? Yes, that's right. The gummy candy we found on the floor is the evidence. Ryoko, your favorite candy is gummy. Correct? What's a gummy? I've never eaten something like that before. It's gumshoe. Yeah. <laughs> Captured the true character of this mystery. Hyoko, who summoned Mahiru to the beach house, hid inside the closet like a familiar. When she saw her chance, she attacked her like an evil spirit and left the beach house like a swift wind. But Hyoko miscalculated that Mahiru's body would be blocking the door at that time. Because of that, she was only able to leave from the beachside door. And ended up leaving her footprints. <laughs> we have presented the proof. My four dark devas of destruction didn't even need to come out. Ich wollte gerade sagen, wenn du das jetzt in deinen Hamster zuschreibst, dass die das rausgekriegt haben. Who's someone? Whose trap is it? It must be that one person. You know, the one with the mask, maybe. The one with the mask. There was a suspicious mask at the beach house, right? Whoever was wearing that could be the real killer. You're the one who wore that mask and killed Mahiru, right? There's no way I'd wear such a childish mask. Is your brain fried or something? Mm, that is right. It cannot yet. be Kyoko. That mask belongs to Sparkling Justice. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Yeah. Huh? Sparkling what now? That mask says it all. Sparkling Justice is hiding on this island. Which means the legendary serial killer Sparkling Justice is the one who killed Mahiru. Why you? If you continue to say such foolish things, I shall tear you limb from limb. Okay. Don't blame Miss Sonia. It's just a difference between cultures. A uh, culture shock, you know? Yoko, why don't you just admit it already? You're being unreasonably stubborn. It's all in your head! Oh, why can't you understand? I'm not the killer! It's true that Yoko is suspicious, but there is something strange. Uh, yeah. Sie hätte niemals die Kraft, um den, um den Schläger so zu schwingen und um immer ja, so zu treffen. Uh, eben. Something doesn't make sense. I can't help but feel like we're being directed by someone. 
Ja. Ohne Kummer schlüpft auch erstmal aus der Kokosnuss. In meine Kartoffel. Ja, ja. <lacht> And afterward, you fled from the beach house. At the time the door facing the road was blocked by the body. So you were forced to flee from the beachside entrance. And that's how you left your footprints. Ich finde das mit dem White Noise einfach dämlich eigentlich. It looks like everyone doubts you, bro. <coughs> Is that really okay? And afterward, you fled from the beach house. Oh, das ist echt schwierig. Es macht halt das alles Sinn, ne? Aber sie kann es nicht gewesen sein. Mhm. Was haben wir denn? Wir haben Cliffus Grape Room, Gummy Bag, Yellow Gummy, Trash Can. Ah! Hahaha! <lacht> das Bärchen war gelb und gelb ist hier nicht drin in der Tüte. Bei gelb signalisiert doch meistens Zitrone. Und jetzt guck mal. Guck mal nochmal rein. Äh, ne? Erdbeer, ja. Melone, Weintraube und Orange. Hm. Macht also keinen Sinn. Wir brauchen also das Yellow Gummy. Okay. There's no doubt. Oder die Gummy Berg, meine ich. Ja. Also hier müssen wir, also bei dem Spiel müssen wir halt wirklich mit den ganzen Truthbulls noch mal so arbeiten, ey. Aber wir müssen halt wirklich mit den ganzen Truth Bullets Arbeit nochmal durchlesen. Ja klar musst du deine, musst du deine, deine Beweise kennen. Darum geht's doch in dem Detektivspiel. Ja nee, das, das meine ich jetzt nicht, aber bei dem Danke nochmal davor, da konntest du halt wirklich so, ja, war das einleuchtend. Aber so musst du halt nochmal, okay, warte mal, was war hier, was stand da, was stand da, hier, stimmt, das würde man passen. Das nicht bei, bei im fünften oder sechsten Fall halt nochmal mit, ähm, ähm, wie hieß er gleich? Hm? Mukuro? Ja, was ist damit? Da war doch auch, da muss man auch in, in, in die Monokuma-File nochmal in die gucken und lesen. Ja, was ist da alles nicht, was ist alles passiert, ne? Ja, gut. Ein Fall, mein Gott. <lacht> ja, und das ist halt vorgekommen, ne? Ja, klar, meistens war es so, ja, ist halt offensichtlich, dass es das hier ist, aber hey. Naja, hier ist halt wirklich, es ist Der echt... Kann, das hier ist ja ein Vorteil jetzt. Naja, aber hier ist halt wirklich... Ah. The only one childish enough to eat gummies is that midget over there. Says the midget. You're a midget too, you know. You're the one who worries about never getting taller. It's true, Hyoko likes to eat gummies. But she only eats a specific brand. The brand of gummies you eat only have strawberry, melon, grape, and orange flavors, right? Huh? But what about the lemon flavor? The... the gummy at the crime scene is yellow. So it obviously looks like it was lemon flavored. Huh? That gummy is yellow? And it's not mine! The ones I eat don't have any yellow gummies! That's right. 
none of the gummy bags in her cottage had any yellow ones. Then we can't assume Hyoko is the one who dropped that yellow gummy. So, yeah, trap. See? Didn't I tell you? It's definitely a trap! <sighs> Damn it! Who would set a trap like this? Oh, get my revenge! I'm gonna bop you on the head with all my might! <laughs> Go to a horny jail. <laughs> 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 Hold on, you little bitch! You think you're in the clear just because of a little gummy? Don't be stupid. I'm not done backing you into a corner yet. Also, ich glaube, jetzt kommt der Schwertkampf, hä? Doch nicht, was? Okay. Ja, mal gucken. Okay, ja, es wird spannend. We're not done with Yoko yet. There's still a huge piece of evidence left. You're talking about the footprints near the beach house, right? It's true, that's an important piece of evidence. And we can thank Mahiru for it. What does that mean? Mahiru used her last ounce of strength and blocked the door to the road. Thanks to her. Yeah, nee, we okay. have the evidence we need. I <laughs> Akane hat hier schon die falsche Aussage. Oder? Was haben wir als Auswahl? I gotta figure out what's right and what's wrong. Toll. We're not done with Hyoko yet. Autopsy Report, da haben wir doch. There's still a huge piece of evidence left. You're talking about the footprints near the beach house, right? It's true, that's an important piece of evidence. And we can thank Mahiru for it. What does that mean? And you don't know. Her last ounce of strength and... No, that's <laughs> wrong. <laughs> Mahiru didn't block the door. Her death was instant. Instant death? According to my autopsy, yes, there's no doubt that Mahiru died instantly. Instant death. Heißt es, was du drüber gehst und fünf Minuten warten? You keep making shit up. I'll fucking kill you! I'm sorry! Ryohiko, you cannot do that. Only a coward threatens women. I'm pretty sure her death was instant, too. I mean, her injury was only a single blow. That's why Mahiru isn't the one who blocked the door. Someone else used your body to block it. Is this someone else? The killer, of course. They're the one who blocked the door with Mahiru's body. That's why there were bloody drag marks left on the floor. But why did the killer block the door? Just ask Kyoko. She's the killer after all. Überleg doch mal, ne? Sie ist so kleines Schwarzmädchen, ne? Wie will sie erstmal mit einem Schlag jemanden mit so einem Baseballschläger wegdünken? Und dann noch jemanden, der vermutlich doppelt zu schwer ist wie sie, keine Ahnung, eventuell, zur Tür ja, schleifen. Wenn man zuguckt, wenn man die, die äh, Character äh, Report Cards gucken, da steht ja eigentlich alles drin, oder nicht? Haben wir die gerade? Tatsache. Report Card. Report Card, also. Mahiru. Erstmal, ne? Yoko okay, ist hoch. So, sie wiegt 68 Pfund. Größe? Keine Ahnung. So. Na ja, fast der Doppelte. Ne? Also... <lacht> würde nicht gehen. Ja. Es ist... Seriously? That's not true! Let's assume Yoko is the killer. Wouldn't that mean she's also the one who dragged the body? If she handled the body that bloody... I think her clothes or skin would have been stained with blood. Huh? But when I saw her, she was... Frisch aus der Waschmaschine, mit ihren verschränkten Armen. Ja. See? I told you I wasn't the killer! Yay! With this, my innocence has been proven! I won't let you look down on me! God damn it. Na dann, Sword Fight. Ah. Hey, Good luck. Nico, why do you keep insisting that Hyoko is the killer? Shut up! 
I'm telling you, she's the killer. That little bitch is definitely the killer. Das ist aber sehr, sehr, sehr sass, ey. If Mahiru didn't block the door, then Hiyoko did it. She killed Mahiru and blocked the door with her body. Hiyoko is the only killer I can think ja. of. Hey, ich konnte konnt gerade nichts machen. So, ich hätte das falsche Schwert. Nein, ich konnte weder was drücken, noch konnte ich was, was zersäbeln. Hm. If Hyoko moved the body, then she should be covered in blood. So what, dumbass? There's a shower room inside the after she moved the body. She just walked the fact that Kacke. Hyoko was at the can be proven by the footprints in the sand. Did you get all that, you bastard? Also, jetzt mit dem richtigen Schwert den, den erste Gelbe dann wegmachen. Genau, genau, genau. Aber. Was stand da? We're using that piece of evidence. There's a shower room inside the beach house. After she moved the body. Ah, here's shower room. She just washed it off in the okay. shower. The fact that he Damn it. was at the beach house can be proven by the footprints in the sand. Did you get all that, you bastard? Okay. So what, dumbass? There's a shower room inside the beach house. After she moved the body, she just washed it off in the shower. Allow me to cut through those words. Okay. Now, washing it off in the shower is impossible because the shower in the beach house was out of order. Out of order? I'm terribly sorry. I haven't had any time to actually repair it. Then maybe she took her clothes off to move the body, and when she was done, she put them back on. Are you saying I did something that perverted? Kyoko took off her clothes before committing murder. No, that should be impossible. Her clothes are used to her body. <laughs> she can't get dressed by herself. Uh, was was? Ah, da, yeah. Hyoko mentioned this before. Which means Hyoko can't change by herself. It's impossible for her to put on and take off her clothes. What? Oh yeah, she couldn't even tie her sash on her own. That's why she couldn't take a bath and smell bad. I I didn't smell. It only smelled a little. Oh, wasn't changing inside the beach house prohibited in the first place? Yes, if you broke the rules, I'm pretty sure Monokuma wouldn't have kept quiet. Damn right! I'm such a stickler for the rules that even Safari Park Rangers want nothing to do with me! If she didn't change her clothes, then what did Hyoko do with the blood that got on her? Like I've been saying, the blood wasn't on me in the first place, because I never touched Mahiru's body! Hey, if you think about it the other way around, does that mean whoever was covered in blood is suspicious? Uh-oh. Mm-hmm. Because if so, I believe Akane was soaked with blood when we all met up to go to the beach. Yep. Mm -hmm. Ja, ob das sich wirklich deckt mit euch beiden. Ja, deswegen... Ne? Didn't I tell you that was because I got beat up by Coach Nekomaru? I can attest to that. If I hadn't gotten that rough with her, she never would have backed out. Dab me of all people. You got some nerve. Es ist halt nur zur Sicherheit, weil du warst die Einzige, die halt mit Blut überströmt war. Und das macht halt so ein bisschen, wenn man Nekomarus ne, confirmed nicht hätten, wärst du halt extrem sass gewesen. Ja, aber man, 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 sie haben ja beide sich schon, schon mal geprüft. Gut, da war nicht so viel Blut dabei, beziehungsweise gar kein. Das war einfach so ein bisschen so Sparring, ne? Aber, ja, ja. ja, trotzdem, das ist halt... Das, ich hab's ihr geglaubt. Ja, 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 ich auch, aber es war halt trotzdem so... Im Allgemeinen dann halt mit dem Fall so... 
wir brauchen wirklich die Bestätigung dafür. Weil einfach so, ja, das glaube ich dir, aber wir brauchen den Beweis. Ja, klar. Sieh ich auch. Please do it. Die kleine Hyoko möchte aus dem Kinderparadies abgeholt werden. Because you're a little piece of shit. Aber, aber trotzdem, ne, wer halt beobachtet, da weiß halt definitiv, das, das kann nicht sein. Oh, hi, Leon. <lacht> äh, ist, ist auch wirklich so edel. Ich, ich kann es halt in dem Sinne, kann ich es halt völlig verstehen, ne? Ja, absolut. Mean Hyoko in 3, 2, 1! Shut the hell up, Pig Bart! I hope you get a hangnail and die! Bing! Wow! Hangnail ist also schon. Hui, fies. Ja. Yeah. So ein. So, so, oder. Wie, wie heißt die? Mietnagel heißt die nicht. Hm? Oder? Sag doch, doch, so, so, so Fingernagel? Der, Ach, nein, Fingernagel, Fingernagel der, der, der so, so richtig schlecht hängt. Den du richtig, den nicht richtig entweder abgeschnitten oder abgebissen kriegst, der sich noch Fleisch oder so mit rausreißt. Ach, du meinst jetzt so richtig schön an der Seite, ne? Ja. Ah. <lacht> More importantly, Fuyuhiko's behavior earlier was definitely strange. Yep. Getting so worked up and accusing Hiyoko of being suspicious. Could it be... Does he actually have something else in mind? Hey, Hiyoko. Now that our suspicions have been addressed, Can you tell us the truth? Huh? Even though you're not the killer, you still went to the beach house, right? Like I said, it was a trap! Yeah, I got that already, so... Can you give us the details about that trap? I would like to know too. It might lead to some kind of clue. Fine. You want me to talk, huh? Um, earlier this morning, Mahiru was the one who came up to me. She asked if we could meet up later. Huh? But didn't you say earlier? Yeah. No, yeah, yeah, never talk. Yeah, obviously. That was a lie. Yep. Damn it! So that was a lie? Well, obviously. I thought it'd be doubted if I admitted it. So I figured it was better not to say anything. So, what was your answer to Mahiru's invitation? I told her it was fine. I mean, I didn't have a reason to say no. Unlike everyone else here, Mahiru was someone I wasn't embarrassed to be seen with. You always have to say something snide. At the time, we were supposed to meet around 2 p.m., but around noon, there was a letter inside my mailbox. A letter? Yeah, this one. <coughs> I was going to tell you in person, but I couldn't find you, so I put this in your mailbox. About what we discussed earlier, it's okay if we change this place. I want you to come to the beach hall at the... Mm -hmm. So someone set them both up. Yep. The killer needed the first witness? Yep. And the body. Wow. Let's give it a secret until we... Yeah, okay. Hmm. Huh, the letter that Hyoko had, doesn't it clearly contradict that other letter? Yeah. I was going to tell you first. Yeah, this is gonna the same thing. Mm hmm Good. I can prove it with this. Yeah. This letter. Doesn't it look like its contents are different from the letter Mahiro had? Yep. Mahiro's letter said to meet at 2.30 p.m. But in Hyoko's letter... Whoa! The meeting times are off! It's also strange that both letters wanted to change their meeting spot to the beach house. It would be plausible if one of them said it. But for both letters to say the same thing? Hyoko, since you wrote it, what do you think? 
Like I she said, didn't. I never wrote the letter. How many times do I have to tell you? It's safe to say a letter was forged by the killer, but which letter did the killer forge? Both. I see. The killer must have forged both letters. The killer forged them so they could manipulate their actions. Yeah, that's how we should think about it. That seems very likely. In fact, if you compare both letters... This is the handschrift. Just as I assume, the handwriting is the same. The content of the letters matches too. Not this part. I was going to tell you in person, but I couldn't find you so I put this in your mailbox. This part... It seems there's someone who wants to interfere with our meeting. And this part, let's keep it a secret. Until then, let's try not to see each other for a while. The, the killer forged both of those letters. In doing so, they were able to control Hyoko and Mahiru to do their bidding, like a netherworld puppeteer. So they completely tricked me. And then, Mahiru's killer! <laughs> How mean! Give me back Mahiru! Really? This is really terrible. Yeah, I'm she's whining pretty hard. So it's it's annoying. But the killer this time didn't discuss their plan with me at all. Really? <laughs> it's all my fault. I'm so ashamed of being unreliable. Here we go again. Once we let our guard down, this happens. We can just lightly punch him to death later. Lightly punch him? What the So based on what the letter said, you went to the beach house at 2 p.m., right, Hyoko? What's most important is what happened afterward. What on earth happened there? <laughs> I fell asleep. Why'd you fall asleep? It's not like I wanted to. I think I was forced to get a whiff of some kind of medicine or something. <gasps> medicine? Sag mal, riecht das nach Chloroform? <lacht> nee. <lacht> I thought that place seemed unsafe. They even have prescription medicines laying out in the open. If you were aware of that from the start, you should have done something about it. <lacht> I'm sorry. When I woke up, I was inside a small closet. And when I rushed out, I I saw Mahiro's body. And that's why you ran out of the beach house in such a panic. I, I was scared. It was really, really scared. Really scared that I couldn't help, but... <laughs> the killer probably planned to frame Hyoko from the start. And for that reason, they summoned Hyoko before Mahiru, put her to sleep, and shoved her inside the closet. So their reason for blocking the door with Mahiru's body was to make Hiyoko leave her footprints as evidence. Everything was done to frame Hiyoko as the killer. That's horrible. I didn't do anything wrong. And I was framed by Mahiru. You've been mean killer. to everyone except Mahiru. Of course I will take offense to that. Please do not cry. Is it really okay to believe her so easily? She might be faking those tears, you know. Selbst wenn sie diese Tränen faked, Beweise. Ja. Die ist, die ist vom Haken. This will never end if you keep being so suspicious. Isn't that what a class trial is all about? The only way to survive is to be suspicious. This is where we go to thoroughly doubt each other. So if you believe in each other so easily, then there's definitely something wrong with you. There's something it's definitely having wrong friends. with you, buddy. You're it's called having you friends. Go. We aren't supposed to doubt each other here. We're supposed to work together. The class trial is where we cooperate with each other, work hard, and aim for victory. The cure well said. everyone else. Two hopes attempting to grasp... Oh, two hopes! hopes. <laughs> Take two shots! And then one more for the one at the end. Oh boy. Oh, 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 oh. Uh -huh. oh no! <laughs> you definitely! Ich glaube, ich muss mir doch nochmal nachschubholen gehen heute. Ich will aber nicht. Seriously, which 
side are you on? I'm Alcohol. On the side of the ah, come on! I'm on the side of the alcohol hope. Alcohol. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Ah, Alkohol Capone oder was? <lacht> okay, der ist gut. Oh mein Gott. Oh. Nagido, I swear to God, shut the fuck up. What did I just say? He's gonna make you, he's gonna kill you. <lacht> Ey, innerhalb von diesen drei Zeilen hat er mich von fast dazu gebracht, das Drittel der Flasche <lacht> auszusaufen. <lacht> Oh man, ich glaub... Motherfucker! Ich glaub, eine Pause ist, wir sollten wir nochmal Oder zwei. Grey, and you do not yearn for your life or even for victory. Also interessant, Mist. Auf jeden Fall, gestern gab es ja noch ähm, eine, 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 eine Instanz, wo, wo sie zwar auch grau gesagt haben, aber mit E, also die britische Schreibweise. Und jetzt macht er gerade eine amerikanische daraus mit A. Bei was jetzt nochmal? Bei Grey. Huh. Gestern hatten wir einen, ich weiß nicht wer das war, hat äh, doch Grey gesagt, aber mit E geschrieben. Aha. Und, und Gundam hat es gerade mit A. Hm. Dachte ich mir so, hm, eigentlich, wenn bei der eine amerikanische Übersetzung ist, würde man ja meinen, was alles mit A geschrieben ist. Und dann dachte ich so, hm, mit E? Kritisch, warum? Deswegen bin ich manchmal mal überlegt, äh, muss so am Überlegen so und, und so verunsichert, wie werden die Grey Grays nun geschrieben? Mit A oder mit E? Yes. Mit äh, also. <lacht> die Grey Grays! <lacht> die Grey! <lacht> also die Grey Grey Grays, wenn er so A, E und Ä hat. Oh! <lacht> Alter! Grimtails 3 confirmed. Mm. Nächstes Jahr. Goddammit. 